it's good to be back and I hope you're all doing well and enjoying your babies today and I have something I wanted to show you here is Miss Nora in this adorable wooden high chair now I found this yesterday at the Goodwill and I'm really glad I got it even though my room is a bit cramped now <laughs> but this is very small and doesn't take up a lot of room, but it'll give me a place to have a baby sitting. And Nora really likes it, and I also had Matthew in it, and he really likes it too. So I think it's pretty cute. And as you can see, it's not super tall, but I really like it. I, it was a little bit wobbly, so I had to use some wood glue, and there was one screw that was loose. And that's about it. I just cleaned it up really good. I was thinking of maybe sanding it a little bit and refinishing it. But it's not in too bad of shape. And it was over there where all the kid stuff is at my Goodwill. And let me see if I can back up just a little bit so you can see, maybe get the full view of it. And you can kind of get an idea of the size. So it fits the small babies just perfectly. And the only other thing I got there was a doll for Mary Beth. And so she wants to show you that. So let's go see Mary Beth. And here she is with her baby doll. And this little doll was in the package. It had never been opened. It had a little hole where you could... Um, touch the baby's tummy and I'll show you what what it does <laughs> oh don't cry baby <laughs> Yeah, and he came with um, this little bottle. That's the one that Nora had just a minute ago. And a little bib. That's so tiny, isn't it? And then this little pink shirt. So I guess you could make it into a boy or girl. So that was cute. I just had to get it because I thought, oh, it's a baby that's brand new in the in the box. And he is uh, just has a little bit of um, limbs. It's very short. And you know what they did, though, for the hat? Do you know how they put those little plastic things in, like on our tags, on our clothes? They had it in his head, and I couldn't believe it. So there's there's like a little hole on each side of his head because his hat was attached. That is just ridiculous. Yeah, so I was able to <laughs> at least get the tag. I couldn't get the tag out because it's on the inside of his head, so I had to push it in. So if I want to, I can... Um, take the head off since I know how to do that and I have new zip ties that I could use But she really likes him. It gives her a nice little toy a little baby toy Yeah, a little baby toy to play with mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so let's check in on the other babies and see what's going on today And here's what my boys are doing today these are all my boys, except for the Reborns. But these are the little kids that like to have fun. And over here we have Matthew Scott, and he's playing with the blocks in the wheelbarrow. He loves that wheelbarrow. And then here is Aiden. Aiden has always liked the wagon the most. And then he likes the Tigger. And it kind of looks like Tigger is really excited about the ride. And then back there is Jacob, and he likes that rocking horse. He uses that a lot, and it fits him really nicely because he is just the right size for that, as well as Noah, too. 
But Noah, as you see, is very busy. I let him play with my rocks, just some of my rock collection, so he could put them in the dump truck. He used to put the blocks in there, but then Matthew likes to play with the blocks. So, and rocks, they do make sense in a dump truck, don't they? <laughs> so these boys are having lots of fun. And then I'll show you what some of the girls are up to. And I'm going to move the camera up. It might get a noisy for just a minute. I hope it's not too much glare. In fact, let me move a little closer. Oh, and here's Teddy. He's going to be telling them a story pretty quick here. Keep everybody interested. And that is kind of a lot of glare. But of course, there's Nora. And there's baby Emma, and she is playing with the pinwheel. She really likes that. She holds it all the time, and she's always hoping for a breeze and so I helped her out and put a fan on it so that she could see how to hold it if you hold it a certain way then the pinwheel spins remember those when you were little I used to love those they were so much fun sometimes I would run with them too <laughs> it's funny it kinda it goes and then it stops and then it gets really fast and it's kinda funny and there's little Charlotte. She's just hanging out, playing with the bunny rabbit. And let me see if I can get just a little bit closer without making too much noise. There we go. <laughs> yeah, so that's what's going on here in the nursery. And I thought today that we should probably change Troy because I haven't changed him in a while. And he enjoys his baby swing and the music and everything. But let's put him in something else. I'll find something cute. And then I will see you at the changing table. Okay, so I found something. I don't think I've ever put him in this before. It's a newborn. And it's by Child of Mine Carters. And it has an alligator. And I just love the shorts. They are so cute nice and bright. So we'll try that on and see what happens. Because he is definitely a newborn. There's some newborn sizes that I have that are just too big for him. So we are going to take off his little hat and we've got to unbutton all of this. And what I like about this baby is his pretty eyes. And I love his eyelashes, too. Let me see if I can get this pillow right. It's kind of a little bit difficult. Because he likes to lean a certain way, this boy. But I want you to be able to see him. Yeah. And maybe with the glare, he might look a little extra pale. But he's not... I hope he shows up good, because he's not that pale in person. Yeah. One time I took him to work and the lady that uh, my accountant has helped, she helps him with, um, you know, the QuickBooks things and all that. She was there at my office and she got to hold him and I took a picture of her holding him. She really liked him. She's hoping to be a grandma, not like super soon, but she loves babies too. And so she likes the, the hobby that I do, and that's, I just really think that's so cool because so many people think it's like scary or something. But no, she can totally see how you know, this is an art and everything. So, I like that. So I am going to just leave this onesie on him because I am putting a dark color on him. And I know you have to be careful with that. But he's going to be in the house. And the clothes have been washed. 
previously. So I can't wait to see them in a different color, some green and blue. I think that will really bring out his, his eyes. I know I don't uh, play with the Reborns as much, but I do love them and I do want to continue to make them. Lately here, life's just gotten in the way, so. But we'll get back to it. Oh, I think my ring is stuck. Oh, there we go. <laughs> hey, you got quite the tummy on you, little fella. My goodness. You got quite the tummy. Yeah. <laughs> wow, these will just fit you around your little belly. Yeah. <laughs> How cute is that? Aw. Let's just see. Oh, those colors are going to be so good. Yes, they are. They're going to be so good on you. I really enjoy dressing the babies and taking pictures. It's amazing how with the pictures, they can look like real babies or like they really have a personality. It's so much fun. And I got his little hand stuck somewhere. I got your hand stuck somewhere. Oh my goodness, you would think that I've never done this before. Yeah, what is wrong with Mama? <laughs> okay, we're gonna have one more to do, so bear with me, baby. Bear with me. Yesterday we went for a walk uh, downtown. There's a bridge and some shops and so it was really fun. It was cooler yesterday, actually bearable. It was humid and it's still humid today, but not as hot. So that was nice to get out. Because on the weekends, it's hard for me, it's hard to get me out of the house, I must say. Look at that, he looks like a little man. <laughs> oh my goodness. He looks like a little man. Yes, he does. Oops, almost, I almost got it. Ah, oh, they make him so tiny. <clears throat> pull the shirt down a little bit. There's lots of fuzzies on this shirt. You need a lint roller, mister. You need a lint roller. Now let's see if I can button this one. Yeah. Are you going to be an alligator today? Or a crocodile? I think this is an alligator. Oh, look at it. <laughs> oh, how cute he is. Aww. Let me see if I can hold him up a little bit more so you can see him better. Here we go. Look at that little face. Oh, his little eyelashes. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, he's heavy. Woo! That's draining my back. <laughs> no, I think it's just the angle. He's not that heavy. Yeah, he's not that heavy. Now I wonder if we should see if there are any socks. I don't know if I have anything that would even go with that outfit. We'll just have to see. Hmm. I think the sock bin is getting pretty full. How about these? kind of have the colors except for the yellow there but maybe I could fold it down well he looks kind of clownish that way <laughs> it's a little much well these are cute they look like tennis shoes let's try these hey 
Yeah, those are really cute. Let's see here. There we go. Well, he's pretty easy to dress, I must say. A little floppy, but his finish is nice and soft. So, boy, wouldn't it be cool if I had alligator socks? I guess I should keep my eye out for those. That would be so much fun. <laughs> and as far as a hat goes, well... I don't think we have a hat. I don't think we have a hat. And where did I even put them? Oh, here they are. Yeah. See, there's the doggy one, which is too big. And this one. This one, this little fishing hat is too big because that fits Jacob. And Tigger. What else is down there? And some blue ones. And a gray one. Nothing in green though, so. I think that he's going to be happy just like this. Yeah. Now let's see if we can sit him up. Because he does sit up. Come on, baby. Show everybody how you sit up like a big boy. Yeah. Yeah, we should have put a different blanket behind you though, huh? Maybe a a boyish blanket. Yeah. I wonder what color of passies I have. Let me see. And is he looking at the camera? I think he is. It's kind of hard to tell. Um, okay. Let's look at pacifiers. Now this is a real small one. Oh, that fits nice. I think that's Aiden's. Yeah, and anything else that might work. These are not magnetized, so those won't work. And let's see. Ooh, there's a green one. It's got a frog. That's kind of like swampy, kind of green and all that. Oh, that's cute. I like the color. Now let me see, I'm gonna pull the camera out a little bit. Make sure you can see him good. Get a good look at this guy. There he is. <laughs> yeah, so this is my little Troy boy. And we are going to have some more fun in the nursery. I'll put him in his swing and he can listen to the music. And just swing, swing, swing. Yeah, swing, swing, swing. Yeah, but he sits up pretty nice. It's because he's so chubby right there. That's why he can sit up, huh? Yeah. Okay, Troy, we are going to go now. And I hope everyone has a wonderful rest of the day. And have fun with your babies. And hold them. And they're very comforting and lots of fun. So we will be back soon. We'll see you later. Bye. Have a good day. Say bye, Troy. Bye.